So I recently got done filming a special video. Um, I, was, I was inspired to um, recreate Marilyn Manson's most iconic uh, makeup looks. I wanted to do more, but <laughs> as I was going through and constantly taking off my makeup and putting it back on, it was like, oh my god. Now, I probably didn't have to do it all in one sitting, but I'm just that kind of person. Like, when I have something in my mind, I want it done now. And so, and I wanted to get it up for you guys as quickly as possible. So, um, it's going to be very fast paced. It's not going to be any talking in it. It's going to be just really straightforward. And, um, also, sorry about not covering my eyebrows. My eyebrows don't look like this in the to, in the video, but um, I did try to cover them, but I was not having um, a good day with doing that. So, I did skip ahead uh, from gluing down brows, but... Um, I do apologize, I'm not going to shave my brows for a video, um, but if you are able to glue your brows down or cover them in any way, go for it. I was getting really frustrated, so I said screw it. So I'm sorry that my brows are visible in these uh, because, you know, Manson obviously, for the most part in a lot of his makeup looks, d doesn't have brows. Um, a few of them he does, but they're not the ones that are featured in this um, this video. I feel like if you have very sparse brows anyway, I don't think it's going to be a big deal um, if you don't cover them. Um, if you have very thick brows, however, I do think it would be uh, a good idea to cover them um, as best as you can. Um, what you could do is glue your brows down and then um, powder them with translucent powder and then uh, you could even put liquid latex over your eyebrows after you've glued them. That way you don't have any hairs showing. Um, I didn't really feel like messing with my liquid latex today. Um, it can leave really weird seams around the eye, so you want to make sure that you use it properly. Um, but that's just a tip in case you want to get rid of any like hair line showing, um, and it'll help kind of give a smooth uh, look to the eyebrow. So keep in mind Manson as far as his makeup goes is never perfect. You will see me with imperfect makeup today because it's literally like thrown on um, and and I think that's what makes Manson Manson. Even like the way he outlines his mouth like you will see that it's crooked on me because it's just like it's meant to be like these big ass lips. So <laughs> And it really made me look like Manson. I was like, I look nothing like Manson. Like, I have this tiny little face, you know, round face. He has a really long face. But somehow, drawing those really big-ass lips on my face made me look like him. It was really, really weird. So, um, as you can see, I have the contact still in. Um, make sure you put your contact in your left eye because um, it's always in his left eye. But when you're looking at it, it's the right eye. So, um, if you're going to do Manson, put it in the correct eye, um, that way you're not looking like a fool. Anything that I use in the looks, like palettes or any other products, I will be listing them in the description box below. If there's any of these looks that you would like me to do its own individual tutorial, um, please let me know and I will definitely re-record that for you. Enjoy the looks.